case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 1990 case, Florida v. Wells, the Supreme Court of the United States ruled that during inventory searches, police officers must adhere to a set of standardized criteria or established routines. The case stemmed from an incident where a man named Wells was pulled over for speeding by a Florida Highway Patrol trooper. After arresting Wells for driving under the influence, the trooper conducted an inventory search of his car and uncovered a locked suitcase containing marijuana. Although the Florida District Court of Appeal and the Supreme Court of Florida deemed the search invalid due to the absence of a specific policy on opening closed containers, the Supreme Court of the United States upheld the decision. The court emphasized that officers must conduct inventory searches in accordance with established policies to protect property owners' rights and prevent the discovery of incriminating evidence. As a result, the marijuana found in the suitcase was deemed inadmissible, vindicating Wells' appeal against the denial of his motion to suppress the evidence. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.